Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Nastasha. If you're new here, I'd love it if you would subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. For today's video, I'm sharing with you guys some more of what's new at Ikea. Just a few new items that they've added recently that I think you guys are going to like. As always, the links to everything are in the description box down below. Also, if you haven't done so already, make sure you follow me over on Instagram. And without further ado, we can just jump right into it. The first thing that I wanted to talk about in today's video are these absolutely gorgeous plates. I know for a fact that these are a dupe and I want to say it's a crate and barrel dupe but these look exactly like a plate that I have already seen before pretty sure don't quote me but I think it's crate and barrel I love the different tones and colors on these plates they just look super expensive super high quality sometimes I like going to Ikea and getting dishes just also because they're a little bit more affordable and to be honest, I break a lot of dishes. I'm a little clumsy. So sometimes I like to get something a little bit more affordable and these definitely have that luxury look to them for less. So I'm definitely gonna pick up some of these for myself and I would highly recommend them. I love the coloring on them. All right, next up is this chopping board. If you're in the market for a larger chopping board, this is perfect. I love these just as decor or even to use them as an actual chopping board. I tend to gravitate towards these when I'm at Ikea and I pick one of them up because I always will use them within the kitchen or I'll use them for some type of decor after I have them for a while sometimes I'll even like spray paint them or restain them and use them as another piece of decor they're just a really great piece to have within the home so I would definitely recommend checking these out they tend to be really heavy and high quality as well next up I'm sharing with you guys these storage containers and these are my absolute favorites if you guys have been following me for quite some time I have a ton of these in white but now that they have like this clear colored version of them I need all of them. I have like the urge to literally replace all my white ones with these because I just love the color on them. I also love the fact that they're not clear, but you can still see what's in them. I just think they're gonna look really good. So I'm definitely gonna do some rearranging and reorganizing after I pick some of these up. Definitely would recommend them. If you don't like the color, they come in white and they are literally perfect for organizing. Next up are these pill-shaped mirrors. Now, Ikea has these in a regular pill shape, but these are the new ones that actually have storage on the back. These are perfect for a bedroom or a bathroom. You can see them here. They have them in the bathroom setting, which is great because you can kind of store stuff behind them. Definitely a better way to go than getting like a medicine cabinet or something like that that just doesn't look good within the bathroom. These are perfect or in your bedroom room you can kind of put all of your like jewelry and things behind it just a really great option the fact that it's a mirror and it's in a trendy like shape but it also has the storage on the back highly would recommend checking that out next up is this picture and frame set now ikea does these all the time you get both the pictures and the frames for 49.99 seriously so affordable under 50 bucks and you can literally just use these as the perfect layout for a gallery wall and add your own photos getting all those frames for 50 dollars is seriously so affordable so you don't have to use the photos that are in them and again it gives you a really nice template on where you can hang them super easy like diy gallery wall on a budget if that is something that you're looking to add to your home next up is this new tv unit that they added in white i absolutely love it you could always go ahead and change out the knobs if you wanted to however i kind of like it as is especially seeing how they styled it in the photos this looks really nice and if i needed something that was like super affordable for a tv stand this one is under 200 bucks literally perfect and i definitely would recommend it you can get the additional storage for it if you want or you can use it just as a tv stand and not get the additional it's pretty much up to you because the pieces are purchased separately but i do really like that tv console all right next up are these larger plates and i just wanted to share them because i really like the shape also they are matte i talked about this in my last video i love the fact that ikea is incorporating more like matte uh dishware and whatnot because i don't always like like the glossy finish so these are a dark gray matte and again i just love the shape of them i also think that these would make a really nice like tray for a dresser in a bedroom just because of their shape so you don't have to actually use these as plates you can even use this again as a plate in the center of your dining table or your coffee table i think those would also be a great addition to the home all right next up is this runner and i wanted to share this because this is very similar to a runner i had like years ago i remember i posted a photo of it on my Instagram and I just love the tones and colors in it and I think Ikea is a really great place to get a runner because runners tend to be those actual rugs that get a lot of foot traffic a ton so I wouldn't recommend spending a ton of money on a runner I definitely also wouldn't recommend spending money on anything like super trendy with a lot of different textures that's super hard to clean these are super affordable 
super easy to clean and then when it gets like super dingy and gross you don't have to feel bad about getting rid of it because you didn't spend a ton of money on it to begin with I also saw these a plant pot with saucers and I thought these were super cute I'm thinking of like getting like a couple of like herbs and planting them like basil and whatnot and I wanted to get a set of planters with saucers that kind of like all go together and I saw these in the new arrivals and I thought they were perfect they're like a little glossy gray I think they would be great for that kind of like having them all in a window or if you just need one small planter these are always great IKEA is great for affordable planters if you're in the market for a new one so I've seen these art cards a few times I did not realize that they were a dollar and 79 cents. These are amazing for a dollar and 79 cents. And I was thinking that you could literally just use these as like little small framed artwork. You can even use a few of these and put them in the frames that I shared earlier if you wanted to get that set. I don't really like them all together, but I feel like I like them individually. Like if you just used one in like a bedroom on your dresser framed, that would be perfect. And you don't have to feel bad about only using one because the whole set is only a dollar and 79 cents so to me these are just a really great buy it is super hard to find really good artwork at a great price and those are extremely affordable all right another one of my favorites that ikea has had recently are their pendant lamps and i wanted to share with you guys this one in particular because it is super cool looking it looks kind of industrial a little bit mid-century modern very art deco it can go with a variety of different styles so that's why i wanted to share it with you guys also i had like so many ideas for a diy i feel like this would be super cool if you like turned it into like a centerpiece with a vase in the middle so what i would do is flip it over and put like a glass vase or a glass cup in the middle and then have like a bouquet of flowers coming out of it i think that that would look super cool on a dining table or a coffee table like as like the centerpiece or arrangement again if you don't like the black you can easily spray paint this white i feel like if you changed it to white it would kind of change the whole vibe of it really so there's so many different things that you can do with these pendant lamps and again if you don't have the electrical wiring where you live you can always just attach these to like a string or add a little bit of a chain hang them up you can even put like a led like remote control puck light and you can totally hack it and have like a renter friendly pendant lamp so many different options that you can do but i really like this one when i saw it all right so i just wanted to share with you guys a few of the new arrivals at ikea when i see them i hope you guys enjoyed this video as always the links to everything will be in the description box down below for you guys to check out if you haven't done so already. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you guys have any specific videos you would like to see, you can let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to follow me over on Instagram because we have some awesome giveaways coming up. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!